Hello out there YouTube friends. I am Cindy and you are watching Sincerely Cindy Settle. Today we're going to open a Transcend by Every box. Okay, so if you're not familiar with uh, Transcend, it is very much similar to the other style boxes. You do have a styling fee. You complete a style profile. Um, there is a referral link, so I will put that down in the description box for you. I believe the referral link gives you 20% off of your first purchase and me 20% off any subsequent purchases that I may make. So, pretty good deal. 20% um, off is always good. Now, <clears throat> if I recall correctly, it's been a while since I've done a Transcend. I believe it was back in the fall. If I recall correctly, I think that they do their clothing in outfits. So everything is separated into outfits and I believe you get more than just your five items that is typical of like your stitch fix boxes. Um, I believe you get like maybe eight to ten items even. So let's dig in and see what we have. All right. It's very pretty in here. So here's what the box looks like. As you open it up, you have a, looks like a note from your stylist, spring forecast, fresh style, ready for your closet upgrade. So what they also have is, yeah, spring. <laughs> this looks like it's gonna be my style note and then also my prices from the clothing that are in here. Um, if I recall correctly, I think that I chose, there are certain themes that you can choose each month for your box. I chose the Aries box since I am an Aries. So this month is my birthday. It was actually yesterday. So happy birthday to me. I'm going to open a box and see if I can find some clothes. All right. So let's see. <clears throat> my stylist says, Cindy, happy Transcend Day. I hope you're enjoying the spring sunshine. And I was thrilled to see you back for another box this month. With the Aries theme in mind, you'll find some fabulous go-to pieces, including one-and-done dresses, <clears throat> lightweight pants, and spring and summer tops, and a wrap you'll be reaching for again and again. Enjoy, and I can't wait to see what you love. Styled for you by Rachel. So you can see there that Rachel signed that for me. And like I said, inside it looks like you have your uh, your price list with your discounts and everything on there if you have discounts you also have your outfits outlined there for you <clears throat> and i'll read through those as i go through the items and then on the back it just tells you what to do next um, that you've got five days to try everything on postmark your returns by such and such day otherwise you are charged for everything in your box um, <clears throat> you've got her back we've got yours give 20 get 20 that is the discount I was referring to, so that referral link will be down in the description box. So we also have a Spring 2021. This looks like it is just a little newspaper that has some outfit ideas and such inside as well. You have your return envelope. This is United States Postal Service. And then you have your little bundles. It looks like everything is bundled together by outfits. So let's see what we have. All right, so this is our first bundle. Looks like we have some jeans and maybe some tie-dye here. <laughs> Pretty. All right, let's open it up. All right, so this is a tie-dye. Looks like it is a, maybe a kimono type of thing, cardigan type of piece. Very cute, I like the colors. We have a peach colored, okay, peach colored tank, v-neck, very cute, looks very comfortable. We have a something white, Ooh. Is this a, oh, okay, okay, I'm not sure about this because it looks like it might be a little short. Okay, a cloth and stone um, tank top. That is a little, looks like it looks, it's a little cropped, but look how cute that hem is. It's got these raw hemmed and it's kind of tiered. It's very cute. It's got elastic around the chest and then of course elastic um, straps here. I like it a lot. I just don't know if I'll be able to wear it, but we'll see. All right, and then we have some cut from the cloth 
um, high rise Connie fab ab ankle skinnies. So skinny jeans, as you guys know, I'm always looking for jeans. Minimal distressing it looks like. Um, and these are gonna be ankle length. So that is outfit number one. Let's see what she says about outfit number one. We'll go over prices at the end. Of course, like always, I will put the prices down there as I try on the items for you. Okay, so outfit number one, get ready for your new go-to wrap. This fun little number goes with all of the tops in this box, whether you rock it with your fave jean shorts or these jeans from Cut. The high rise nips you in while the ankle length is perfect for warm weather. Go bold with this v-neck, adding some fun layers with this scrunchy strap tank. So they're recommending wearing the tanks together. So that's an option. I will try it and see what I think. Okay. Let's see what else we got. Do we want to go ahead and try this one on or go to the next outfit? I think we'll try this one on and then come back to the next outfit. All right. I'll be right back. Okay. So this is outfit number one. We have the uh, tie-dye kimono. It kind of has whites and peaches and grays in it. It's very comfortable. Um, I could see, you know, pulling for this a lot in the spring and summer. It is very lightweight, very cozy. Not sure that it's quite my style. I'm not usually one to grab something to wear over in the summertime, unless it's something that I'm gonna wear to work, which I wouldn't be opposed to wearing this to work um, on a casual day, like a Friday or a day when I don't have meetings and things like that. So this is the kimono or wrap as they called it. And then I went ahead and layered it as they had suggested, as Rachel had suggested with the peach underneath and then the white tank. So um, I think I would prefer this without the tank underneath it. And it, this just doesn't, the V, it just doesn't work for me. Again, in the summertime, I'm really not interested in layering items because I'll get too hot. Um, but I think this white is really cute and I'm surprised that I like it as much as I do. So we have the straps that are elastic. We have the band here that's elastic that goes all the way around. Um, it is layered. It does have this raw hem that you can see there um, on both of the tiers. It's very cute and very comfortable. This might be a contender. I'm definitely gonna try it on without the shirt underneath um, to see if I like it with shorts or just with jeans as well. So I'm going to pause this here for a second, take this off so that you can see the tank and we will talk about the jeans. I'll be right back. Okay, so moving on to the V-neck tank top, peach collared, love the collar, love the V-neck. You would have to wear a razor back um, bra with this if you wanted to go without wearing something over it. Let me show you what the kimono or the wrap looks like with this collar, which I think will be much more flattering than wearing it with the white. I like the collar better than with the white. I do like the white shirt, just not with this necessarily. So anyway, here's the tank. I do like it. I do feel like it's more flattering in the front than it is in the back. I feel like a little bit too much of the bumps and rumps and all that stuff are a little bit more visible towards the back. Um, and I may not be quite a fan of that, but let me know what you think. Um, I do like this collar on me. I like the, um, the brightness of it. It's very spring and summerish. Um, I could see me wearing it with a lot if I can manage to tolerate the back. So we'll, we will see. Um, we'll see, but let me know what you think. So then we're moving on to the jeans. These are cut from the cloth. Um, I like these as well. They fit me well um, around the waist. They seem to fit well everywhere else. They are more of a, they do come down to the ankle on me. I thought they were gonna be a little bit shorter, but um, easily rolled um, and they're very comfortable. They are not sliding off of me. They aren't loosening up as I wear them, which is a good thing. 
I like the wash. The distressing is not too much distressing. So I like these too. Let me know what your experience has been with cut from the cloth. Do they loosen up over time after you wash them several times? Am I not going to like them anymore? And of course, it's going to depend on the price as well. So, so far so good. Rachel's done a pretty good job. All right, next. Let's see what we have next in our next bundle. Here's our next little, little bundle. Looks like we have some pretty spring collars in there. And then some navies, navy and florals, which I like. All right. We got. Oh, is this going to be a dress? Oh, it is, and it looks like it's pretty. Okay. Oh. Oh, it's so cute. All right. So this is a dress, super cute. Got some ruffles here. I love the collars. V-neck. Um, it is a tiered. Looks like it's a midi dress. So I'm excited about that. And then we have, this looks like it's another dress, which you guys know I like dresses this time of year. This is a smocked dress. It looks like it is a spaghetti strap. Um, love the pattern of this floral. Looks like it is also a midi. Very, very cute. Look how pretty that is. Oh, like it. Oh my gosh. I like a lot of this. This might not be good for the old pocketbook. All right, let me try these on. I'll be right back. Oh, let's see what she says. All right, so this is, this is actually outfit number three, but we'll go ahead and try it on. So, one and done pieces are an absolute spring and summer must, and these give you two completely different looks while being so versatile and easy to throw on and go. Add a touch of sass in the most feminine way, feminine way, with this dream a girl dress from BB Dakota. It's more of a dare with the animal print with unique touches to make it extra special. As for this free people piece, it has the most gorgeous floral print and a stunning silhouette. Both are great on their own and under a jean jacket. I didn't even notice the animal print. And that's good for me because I'm not a fan of animal print. But now that she points it out, I do see it. And it's very subtle. So I'm good with that. All right. I will be right back. Okay. So let's jump into this first dress. Love the color combinations. I think it's really springy, very bright, vibrant, but not overwhelmingly so. Um, the mix of the animal print in there is very subtle. I like the keyhole opening here. You do have a tie front right here as well as some ruffle right here ruffles along the arms elastic waistband here and I'm just going to get a little closer so you can see the print in there and the pattern in there the it is a tiered length it is a midi let me pan down well I'll pan down here in a minute and show you the length of this it is very flowy very lightweight I really like that part of it, what I don't like is this piece here. Now, you guys know that I am a fan of ruffles and these little feminine pieces, but what I don't like is I don't like how here you can see my bra under the arms. Um, it's not a whole lot, but it's enough to where it bothers me. Um, I just don't feel like that's flattering and I don't know how much this is yet you guys will know but you know especially if you're going to spend a lot on a piece that you're going to wear for several years you want to make sure that there are things that don't bother you such as this so let me show you the back and then I'll pan down and show you the length so let me know what you think I'm going to pan down um, again, there's a lot of things that I like about it, but this is one thing that, um, I don't. So let me know what you think. Um, is that something that bothers you too? And here you have the length. I went ahead and paired it with just some sandals, kind of your rock and roll sandals and your sweet and innocent ruffles and frill. Um, anyway, but there's the length. It is a true 
midi length, which again is not necessarily a length that I would gravitate towards. Um, but it's a very pretty dress. I'm just not sure that it's for me. All right, let's get to the next one. Okay, so at first glance, first try on, I really like this dress. Um, it's very comfortable. I like the straps. Now, you will have to wear a strapless or a jacket or something over it. You know, it does show the bra straps. This here is all smocking, so there's a lot of give and a lot of comfort there. Um, it does you know, stops right here, the smocking stops about right here, and then it just kind of flows. I like the difference in the floral patterns going across. I think it's very unique, um, very pretty. It's very flowy, very lightweight material, which I like for spring and summer. This is more of a ankle length as opposed to a midi, which I prefer as well. So I will pan down and show you that in just a minute, but let me show you the back. The underarms are covered. Um, in terms of the bra strap and everything. So I feel like this is a flattering look for me and I feel like this is something that I would wear quite a bit. I would wear to work with something over it. Even a blazer over it would look pretty. Um, as well as in the summer, I would wear it to the beach or out to dinner or something like that. So let me pan down and show you. But first, I have to do a little twirl. Here we go. Yay! Oh, and let me mention too that it is lined, which is another bonus. So it does have a lining um, so that you cannot see through it, but it is a very thin, very lightweight. There's a lot of airy stuff going on here. So I'm really liking that. So let me show you the length. All right, so there you can see that it is hitting very much right there, right above the ankle, um, but not quite a midi. Um, up there and not quite a maxi where it's hitting the top of my feet. So um, I like that length. It's a length that's new to me, but I like it. Um, I don't feel like it looks like it's too short or that it's too long. I don't know. It's just a lot of fun. I'm sure it's going to be expensive. So we shall see. And I'll have to watch the footage back. So we have one more bundle. I'll be right back. Okay, so we're ready for our final bundle. Here is our final bundle. Looks like we have some stripes and some pink. Gosh, trends in. Maybe this is why I don't do trends in very much because I like everything. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got. Why am I putting on my glasses? All right, so we have something gray. Looks like a t-shirt. Cute, very cute gray I'm not sure feathers is that feathers is that a fire what is that oh coastal Co costa azul with a moon there very cute tea we have looks like a pink tea looks like it might be cropped which is not necessarily my thing but we'll see i like the collar and then we have some striped black and white pants these look like something that I will love if they fit. So it looks very cozy. They are wide leg. Looks like you could wear them with a lot of different things. So I'm excited about, oh wait. Oh, and they have a cute, they tie on one side and they have this opening down here on the hem. So they have one side tied and one side open. So I guess they're just showing you options. So we will try them on that way and see which way I like it the best. All right, let's see what she says about this outfit. Outfit number two, easy breezy and fun to mix and match with neutrals and brights alike. You'll be living in these beachy pants all season long. You can keep them long with the slit as is or even give it a side tie for a different silhouette as I have demonstrated. Thank you, Rachel. Go bright and bold with this pocket tee, adding a fun message and a great neutral with this Costa Azul graphic. Although we do not send sneakers in Transcend yet, the Alley sneaker from the New Balance on Every.com are a great go-to. Nice. So I, I probably did ask for general neutral um, tennis shoes, 
in this box. I couldn't remember if they were a box that sent shoes or purses or anything like that, but I am looking for like a white or neutral collared uh, shoe to go with kind of a little bit of everything, with jeans, with shorts, that sort of thing. All right, so let's try this one on. Okay, so we're getting started on our last bundle. So here we have um, the last pair of pants, which are very comfortable. The last, well, not the last t-shirt, there's a pink t-shirt, but this is very cute, very comfortable, um, very casual, which I like. They look cute with these pants, you know, very casual. You could tie this over here that would be cute as well you could pretty much wear this with anything um with shorts with jeans you know cardigan no cardigan jean jacket whatever um, very comfortable the pants are um here are my thoughts with the pants elastic waistband which i love um here seems to be a little slightly snug i did have to try on like two or three different pairs of underwear so that I didn't feel like this was fitting me weird. Um, and it still may even be fitting me weird. I can't really tell in the monitor. But um, I like the vertical stripe. They are very lightweight. I feel like they are flattering. I don't feel like they look too tight. They don't really feel too tight either. Um, but it was right here in the front that I just felt like you could see the outline of the underwear pretty significantly where you would have to wear something over it like that which I don't necessarily want to do if I want to tie this up or if I want to wear something cropped or something like that I want to be able to do that so and it could be that the rise is a little bit I don't know there's just something about right here I'll have to look back at the footage but let me show you um, the split in the leg, it's super cute. Um, again, these are very flowy, very comfortable, um, and I really like the detail here on the side of the leg. So let me show you that. Okay, so as Rachel had mentioned in her note, she did tie one side, um, which is a very cute look. Um, I like that very much so. It kind of looks genie-ish, if you will. And then you have the open side over here, which is equally cute. Um, this side, I could, you know, you could dress these pants up with heels if you didn't want your uh, pants to drag or tie them up, wear them with flats. Um, but I think they're very cute, very comfortable, very airy. Um, I like them a lot. I'm just not sure about this right here. And of course, I haven't seen the price. So let me try on the second shirt with these and I'll be right back. Okay, here is the last t-shirt. Uh, I like the collar. I feel like the collar looks very pretty with the black and white, very casual. Um, it is more of a cropped top. Um, I'm not sure about this placement of the pocket. Not really, really a big fan of that. I'm not sure. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of pockets on t-shirts. I mean, really, what are you gonna do with this pocket? What are you going to put in that? I mean, I would much rather have some sort of different detail. But anyway, not a fan of this. Not sure that I like the crop so much. Um, but I do like the collar. I like the collar with the black and white. I think she did a good job styling it as an outfit. I'm just not sure that the top is for me. All right, let's sit down and do the wrap up. Let me see all of these prices and see what I might keep and what I know I'm sending back. I'll be right back. Okay, I think we are ready for the wrap up. All right, so let's see, we have the wrap. I'm gonna do this by outfits. So the first outfit, we have the wrap. It is a Tory wrap. It is $62.40. There is a little asterisk beside these prices, so I'm assuming that means that I have the 20% discount. Also, if you keep four or more items, you get an additional 10% off of your total. Um, and your styling fee is credited towards anything that you wish to keep. Um, the wrap is probably gonna be a no-go for me. That's a little high for a wrap. The jeans are 7120, which are a possibility. The white tank top by Stone and Cloth, very good price. It is $20, $19.99. Then we have the other tank, City Tank, in extra large, is that right? It's by Z Supply, yes, by Z Supply, 
is $31.20. That's probably going to be a no. That's a little pricey for a tank top, although I did like the v-neck and I liked the collar. I think we can do better. Um, second outfit, we have the Costa Azul t-shirt. It is $15.99. Very good price. That might be a possibility. And then we have the striped pants. And these are $78.40. That's a little high. I was hoping they'd be like 40 bucks. So those are probably going to be a no-go. That's a little high. Then we have the pink uh, pocket tee. It is $15.99. Was not a huge fan of that, although I do like the collar. Then let's get to the dresses. This is the Come Together Midi Dress Black Combo from Free People, which I really, really liked, but it's $134. So that's probably going to be a no. Unless my husband wants to get it for me for my birthday. So we'll see. All right. Then we have the last dress, which is Dream a Girl dress in yellow. And it is $95.20. So this had a lot of cute elements to it. I just don't think it was for me. So this is going to be a no for me. So I do have four items in my stack that I'm thinking of keeping. That would be an additional 10% off. But then I'm probably looking at about... 250 bucks or something like that so that's probably going to be a no-go so i will have to pick and choose a couple of items um i am going to look back at the footage to see what i really really love what i feel like looks really great on me because as you guys know i'm only buying things that i really love um, i'm trying to improve my wardrobe trying to make sure i buy pieces that i will wear in you know years to come so I'm trying to get my style back and I need your all's help. So let me know what you guys liked, what you think was flattering, what you think will stand the test of time. Um, I love hearing from you guys. I like getting your comments. So please like, subscribe, and comment. Let me know what you loved about this box. If you like these kind of videos, I would love it if you would subscribe. And I will see you guys the next time with a Stitch Fix unboxing and try on. I will see you soon. Have a great day. I am sincerely Cindy Settle. I am signing out. Mwah!